Okay, I've been preparing this thing for a while and I think it's worth showing. So I'm running a test right now um, with JBeter. And here's the chart I've created. Uh, it's a full dashboard um, I'll be using for troubleshooting my application. Right? So it has all the basic stuff like errors over time. You have the average response times, what's the throughput, how many threads are running, and some summary, even some errors there so you can see what exactly went wrong. But this is the basic stuff, right? You have it everywhere you want. Uh, if we want to see, for example, uh, a specific transactions, I can just go here. I can see my HTTP request, how it's doing. Uh, but if I want to drill down some more, I can just you know mark these and the resolution of this data will be at the millisecond level, right? So it's, it's pretty low level and it's, you can drill down into micro features and you can see exactly what went wrong with the application. But you want to know more, right? We're running HTTP request here, so you probably can squeeze out more of it. Um, for that, you can just go to the specific transaction, right? So it has a separate dashboard that is gonna uh, take you to it. Uh, in here, you can see exactly the throughput. You can see the statistics, like what's the full response time, what's the latency, what was the connect time. So that stuff you don't get anywhere else. Uh, also, all of this in relation to your SLAs, right? So you can just pre-populate your SLA in the database somewhere and it's gonna compare those to your, uh, to your needs, right? Over here, you also see the tempo traces, but the magic with tempo traces I've found them the most useful is with a Kafka request, right? So um, when I want to see the Kafka request that I'm sending right now, which, which I'm also doing, by the way, I have a service running in the background. Um, I have here the uh, Kafka request. From a load generator perspective, the Kafka requests are going to be rather fast. Right? because I can only measure how long it took me to send this message. But then, if I want to see exactly what went wrong here, I can use the tempo traces to figure out what was the end-to-end -end time from my computer, so from my load generator, back to the application, right? And it's even better because I can just, you know, seek specific logs, I wanna see exactly which request came here, I can just see the details here, and this dashboard is gonna take me directly to the tempo trace I have on my computer, right? So my application and my JMeter are both instrumented with open telemetry. So um, this lets me use both the tools and I can leverage the whole, uh, the whole Grafana stack to uh, present the whole load and to drill down exactly and find out exactly what went wrong during my load test, right? Without even leaving this, this whole, um, this, uh, this stack. And I think it's pretty cool.